Today, the Austin Central Library had a hype party for a new free music streaming service it's starting. In just a few months, you'll be able to stream music from local musicians on the library's website. Keg Sands Alyssa Gore dropped by today to show us what to expect. Austin band like this, you may have to head to a venue or hope they have their tracks up on Spotify. Austin's new central library wants to change that. Thank you to the Austin Public Library. What a beautiful library. How about it? They are now accepting applications for musicians in town who want to have their music featured on a free streaming service. We're going to pick the 50 best. And then the process of licensing them, uh, and we're going to pay $200 to these um, other their bands, musicians. The songs will be streamed from the library website starting in early 2019, so you can listen even if you don't have a library card. Dale Kittendorf says this is a project four years in the making. We are the live music capital of the world, um, and most libraries across the country are kind of getting into this kind of thing. It's just one piece of the vision to make this new library not just a place you go to check out books, but a community center. Plus, the library says it's a better deal for everyone involved than Spotify. And we want the musicians to be successful, and we want the, our library patrons to be entertained. So we think it's a win, win for everybody. Alyssa Gord. Should be fun. KXAN News. And it is not too late to check out the Electric Ladybird debut event. It runs until 8 o'clock tonight, so head on out. It's beautiful uh, weather out there for yeah. it. Del Watson takes the stage at 615. And if you are a musician, just head to atxlibrary.music. AT.co, you can do that uh, and enter through November 30th.